Hello YouTube. Um, so after seeing a Reddit post about early economy and how to beat the moderate um, AI, I decided to record this game. Um, I'm just gonna start a game here and play random. Um, the difficulty is moderate. Arabia, tiny maps and the resources. So basically what you would play if you played online. Uh, I got Cumans, my opponent's playing Incas. Let's see what it, what happens here. I'll play with the mouse only, so no hotkeys, no fancy micro, you know, just keeping things really, really simple here for the beginners to be able to follow. Um, I'll do a very simple build order. And just make sure the scout is working, make sure the villagers are all working. Um, I'll follow a very simple bit order here. I'll play archers and then I'll play knights. Okay? So, humans as a civilization doesn't have really any economy bonus, so there's nothing I can exploit uh, to speed things up or anything like that. Um, humans actually are uh, not really the best Arabia civilization, which is great for this content because I'm playing with one of the weakest civs and it, you'll see how it's actually quite easy to to beat the AI with. Um, so, six villagers on food, that's enough to keep my TC producing villagers all the time. Um, so we don't want to be taking the small trees around the TC, we actually want to be on a forest and we want to build a lumber camp touching the, the edge of that forest, the outskirts of the forest there. Uh, this would actually be a much better forest, but it's okay. Uh, we didn't know about that one. Uh, always keep the food under the TC. One sheep at a time. You don't want your villagers to kill a lot of sheep at the same time. Um, and look for your boars. Okay, I have three, four villagers now. I'll actually get a loom first. Because I'm going to be luring a boar, and I think for beginners it's easier to do with loom. So I don't need sheep anymore under the TC, I'll eat some boar. Look how I've distributed my villagers around the wood camp. I've also found my second boar here. So let's... Um, I might need to kill a second sheep here, because I got loom, so it delays my villager a little bit. Okay, I found everything I wanted, so I'll just put my scout in auto scout and I'll get this boar coming here. I'll get another villager. Okay, now let's be careful with the boar. We want the villager to shoot once at it and then run back to all my other villagers. I'll have all six villagers shoot this boar for me and this guy will build a house here. Okay, and let's not lose the villager. That's brilliant. Oh, going according to plan, um, I'll make a mill, the mill can touch the berries, and now let's do the same, distribute the villagers evenly around the mill, uh, with two in each side here, okay, you're gonna build another house actually, good, okay, I've got three villagers there, let's drop some food here to keep the Villager production, because now I'm going for the next boar. Good, you can go there, and the next villager will be on the berries, because I need four on berries. So, so far, this is super easy. Um, I'll have four villagers on the berries, four villagers on the wood, and every other villager will be helping with the boar. There we go. So I basically had six on food, four on wood, then I had one villager collect a boar, three here, another villager collect another boar, then I get my four villagers on the berries, and now everyone else will be helping here. Okay, I've got 19 population already, so my 20th population will be uh, muting my barracks, because I have the wood for the barracks already. Okay, this villager is not working, let's get them to work. Uh, barracks. Let's go. 
Okay, I have 10 villagers on the, the GC ship. I'll get another two. Okay, don't get stuck there. That's why you distribute the villagers, because they get stuck all the time if you're not paying attention. Okay, he's got an eagle. Okay, these are not working anymore. Let's get them to work. I'll get a fifth villager there, and I should be ready to click up right now. Yeah, let's click up. So I have five villagers here. What I need is another five villagers to go there. I have my second. I have my second um, lumber camp now. Same logic, touching the wood. And this guy has completed the barracks, so build a house. I'm finishing my sheep here, I have 5 villagers there, 5 villagers here, so I'll be playing archers, so let's collect some gold as well. I'll send 3 villagers to go to start with. Of course I'll need a mining camp. For the mining camp you don't want it touching the, the gold. The logic is that with the... actually I won't build a house now. The logic is that villagers chop through wood real fast so they will easily collect all of these because it's just a hundred the goat however has 800 so we don't want them to be walking around too much so just keep it here uh, yeah okay You're done. so they can very efficiently work there this villager will actually build um my archer ranges my scout still hasn't found, found my opponent uh, i'll just look for it myself now okay let's get a one archer range going and a second one as soon as possible let's get more villagers let's send them to go because two archer ranges we require um i would say eight villagers on gold should be well actually too much i probably have seven villagers on gold there uh most important great get double bit axe for the wood choppers so now I'm going to be paying attention to this for the rest of the game. I need my TC to be running at all time. I want to see a villager in queue all times. This might be on top of your screen instead of down there. And now I also want to see archers being produced non-stop as well. One villager will continue to make houses. The other villager will make a blacksmith. TC has to be running. I've got five there now. And as soon as I have 60... Uh, wood, I'll make a farm. Okay, so TC running. I've got six villagers there now. Let's see if that's enough. I'll switch off there. Okay, this villager continue to make houses. And now that's why I didn't go for the trees near the TC early on. Because I, I, I'll keep sending villagers there as soon as they come off of the TC. So they, they have work to do. As soon as they get out until I've got the time to put them on a farm. So that's the logic behind that. Okay, this villager can out. Let's finish walls here and let's get fletching. Okay, so keep paying attention. Ooh, I'm missing a villager. And I need to get an archer. Okay, as I thought, um, six is barely cutting it, so let's add another one there. Let's go for seven. On the goat, um, yeah. Okay, villager coming. Let's finish rolling this side as well. I don't need this one actually. Let's keep making houses. Oops, almost out of villagers. And getting an archer. Okay, brilliant. Uh, so I've now got the attack upgrade to my archers and I'm in a very good position to start playing offensively. I've got 8 villagers on gold. Let's just keep this guy inside here. Okay. Make a farm. Okay, I got 8 villagers. Let's go to attack now. I don't know where my opponent is, but let's find him. Who? Cool. That's decent. Let's keep making villagers, keep making farms. Yeah, I can queue up another archer, queue up another villager, I've got enough to make, okay I got housed pretty badly here, let's speed up this house, 
So while I'm housed, I'm gonna get Will Barrel. Ooh, found my opponent. So I'll just leave my archers here. Stand ground, found some villagers. I don't have to spend time watching it. Let them fight. Okay, we got another house going. Um, you guys can go back to farms now. Yeah, good. I'll get Will Barrel here. Okay, I just left them there. Enemies gone. Dead. Let's get more archers going. Another farm. Another farm. I've got a lot of wood, so let's spend the wood. Okay. This guy's done. Let me make another farm. Okay. Another two archers. Okay, now I should be thinking of going up to Castle Age. Okay. So. I'll make a couple of more villagers here. I have too many on gold now, so I'm gonna take one out. And the second. Okay, I've got here. Good. Let's go with the archers again. Oh, look, an uh, villager. Um, have too much. Gold, spend the gold, spend the wood. Okay, a second batch of archers will go back to that gold. Stand ground, I don't want to lose them to town center. So just... I'm not doing any fancy stuff here, just attacking units as I see them. Okay, let's skip here because there's a villager. Oops, to see idle. Let's get another villager going. Brilliant. You can get more archers. I just need 200 to click up, and now I'm waiting for my food to go up, so I can um, reach Castleage. Get another villager there. I'm killing a lot of villagers here. I'm still killing a lot of villagers there. Ooh, I found his stone, uh, his wood lines. That's brilliant. Let's attack this Skimshur because it's it's killing me. Let's kill this guy here as well. And I've got enough to click up. Up, I go. Brilliant. Uh, as soon as I click up, I'll be getting Hoss Collar here. Uh, and these two guys will build a stable. Oh, there's a hole somewhere. Yeah, right here. Good. Let's get the gold upgrade now. I don't even care about the archers. Ooh, I didn't want them to go under the TC though. Okay, I lost all my archers now. But it's okay. Okay, let's get a second stable going, and let's get the gold upgrade here. Now I need more on gold, so I'll send another village there. I can send one from here, and let's build a another stable. Okay, I still have more archers, so send them forward, send them back to the gold there. Let's get upgrades for the knights. Another stable, and bloodlines. So super easy. Wow, this wolf snipe. Sniping my villager. Super easy economy. I have the same villagers on wood that I had from the beginning. 8 on gold here. 18 farmers, which is a lot of farmers. Um, I can now switch back to gold here because I need 10. And let's keep making houses. I, I gotta com complete this wall here. Hmm. Some outside there. Good. Now I'm Castle Age. I'll make knights. I'll get the second armor upgrade for the knights. Now get a house. Okay, I've lost all the archers. I don't care about the archers, as you can see. <laughs> Wood upgrade, as always, it's the most important one. Um, and let's get villagers, as always. Okay, as many archers, as many knights as I can. I have too many villages queued up here. Let's get more knights. Brilliant. Now this is good. And then the same same logic applies. Villagers will come to wood here. And I'll keep getting knights. And I'll keep getting villagers. Super easy. I don't even have to look at them for too long. This mining camp is no longer very effective. Like the, the villagers are walking a lot. So what I can do here is build a new lumber camp. Okay. So I'll build a new lumber camp, touching the wood again. 
This is slightly better. They're not walking that much. So let's keep getting farms and keep getting knights. Really easy. Okay, I don't have enough wood, so send this guy to gold. Let's wait for the wood to increase. Good, got the wood, got the villagers, got the knights. Okay, six knights. Let's take a look at okay, eight knights. Even better. Let's go back to attack my opponent. Uh, let's put the waypoint a bit closer to them. So this is it. 25 minutes. I'm attacking with eight knights. I've already attacked with a lot of archers. I don't have to be spending too much time looking at them. Because I want to keep my TC running here. Oh, he's trying to attack me here with an archer. So let's just keep making knights. Yeah, the knights are doing a good job there. I just don't want them to be under the TC. And I also want to have the armor, the, the attack upgrade. Okay, need to get more units going. Okay, under the TC is, a, is too far. Okay, this villager didn't have to go there as well. Good. So I still have my 8 cavalry. Uh, I've killed all his army, I've killed all his villagers. He's under the TC. I'm in a good position here. Okay, more villagers. More farms. Just keep going. Now this goat line here it has too many villagers on this goat, so let's go for another. There's another one right here. And I still have my villagers there. Um, yeah, I want to get a siege workshop now. To make some siege. So I'll just send more villagers to this goat, to this wood, sorry. So I can get more siege going. Still making knights. Now instead of 8, I have 13. This is all played with simply um, just the mouse button, uh, and I haven't used my hotkeys at all. Just keep making stuff. Good. Now let's get a ram going there. I can turn on this. Yeah, no problemo. Okay, knights two running around. I don't have to be watching them. He's making some pikemen now. It's fine. I don't care. Um, okay, two guys are get collecting stone. That's why it's a bit slow on the goat side here. Let's get some siege going for us. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, I don't have to pay attention. Knights just kill everything. Good. Keep making knights. He's making a lot of spearmen. It's not a problem. I don't care about that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I want to get this upgrade though. Keep making villagers. Notice how I'm never, uh, I never stop making villagers here. Okay, now I have so much wood that I can make a second town center. Uh, where do we want the town centers? Town centers are usually good when they are protecting resources, and uh, especially if it's more than one resource. So I get, I'll get my town center here. Okay, I need to get a couple of villagers to wood because I'm using them to. To build there. Um, a few more. Okay, now he's got a lot of pikemen. I probably want to take a fight before he, he's got too many of them though. And let's the, go for the town center there. I don't have to be paying attention to this. It's fine. Yeah, he resigns. It's over. So, this was me beating the moderate AI. Notice how I didn't even get attacked. I didn't do any fancy stuff. I just sent two army of archers forward, and then I've sent two armies of 
knights basically. I've got a few rams, which I was going to use to destroy his town center. And uh, the whole thing here is that I simply keep making villagers and military at all times. And that's it. I don't have to be watching the military for a long time. I just make sure they're not under the TC. And if it's not under the TC, it's fine. You know, keep my numbers together, kill the villagers when I find them, and that's all. You know, other than that, just keep a good economy running. I can make more army as I go. And, and that's it. It's super simple, super easy. I did it all with the mouse. Um, so I hope by the end of this, you you guys um, can replicate, try and do similar build order, try and do similar timing, similar number of army. Um, see if you can get to to the same amount of villagers that I have, same amount of army that I have, and uh, I'm sure you'll be able to beat the AI quite consistently if you can replicate this. Okay, um, that's it. Thank you. Bye bye.